What is up, Pokemon Ninjas? We are searching for some Blue Eyes cards, maybe even a Dark Magician Girl. Um, I believe there's a Spell Roller pack in here. And then some uh, we got some Metal Raiders and some more Blue Eyes packs. So we are hunting for some nice rare cards. We're going to start off with this. I know it'll probably bounce over to a LOB. See if we can get a nice LA Blue Eyes White Dragon pool today. Maybe even a uh, Toon Blue Eyes Dragon. What do we have here? Uh, Thunder Force Attack. I don't think that's probably anything special. So, set that aside. Let's go with a Spell Ruler to start us off. Can we get a Blue Eyes Toon Dragon? Eh, I guess we'll do the card trick. It's four. I think it's four. House, Magical Labyrinth, Slot Machine, Minar, H. What up? I always thought that was an LLB card. Maybe I'm wrong. Eternal, Queen, Bird, Nimble. And that was it. I guess it was just three. I think I did that wrong. All right. Blue Eyes. Can we get that? Let's try three. I think it was three. So we've got a Mountain. Got a Wasteland. Petite Dragon, Umi. We get all the lands here. King Fog. Turtle Tiger Air. Beast Fangs. Grave Digger Ghoul. And a Dark Energy. So... Nothing going in that pack. We'll go one more blue eyes. We've got quite a few blue eyes packs, so we can uh, burn a couple here. I have pulled the blue eyes from these uh, 25th anniversary packs, but I would not mind pulling another one. Umi, Laser Cannon Armor, Petite Angel, Spirit of the Harp, and a Furious Sing King. Uh, let's go Tactical Masters. I think there's some collect I think this was a collector rare set. So was a seven cards. We'll do three. I think it's three there. Duelist Alliance. Invader of Darkness. That's from uh, Invasion of Chaos. Bear Blocker. Uh, Fiend Griefing. Valence Buster Baron and a Trap Trick. Not sure if there's anything of value there. Uh, let's go ahead and do this Pharaoh's Servant Pack. Maybe we can get us a Genzo. Don't think I've ever pulled a Genzo from any set. Uh, we got Dooku, Royaiba, Sky Scout. So weird that they... Why would they... Why did they change the name of that? I don't... I, do you guys know why they changed the name of the Harpy's Brother? World Suppression. I, I, I know Rux, Ruxin said something about it. So I was like... Never seen it until now. I don't know why they would do that, but I don't, know. I don't see it being offensive. Maybe girls didn't like guys having a archetype specifically for them taken away. I don't know. Hitatsumi Giant Fusionist, and I did the card trick wrong again, but nothing there. Let's go on to one of these. Uh, I forget what the Wild Survivors was in here, I think. And this was Metal Raiders. If there's anything I want from Metal Raiders, it's definitely going to be the Black Skull Dragon. Hands down, one of my favorite Yu-Gi-Oh cards of all time. And uh, the one thing I... Oh! <laughs> I, did, I did that pack trick wrong, but uh, there we go. We got a... Uh, what is that? Collector's Rare, right? Man, it's been so long since I pulled a Collector's Rare. I wasn't even expecting that. Uh, I don't know the value of this card. I'll have to look it up, and I'll try to post it in the uh, video. And we'll see what uh, kind of value we got on that card. Be nice if it's a pretty expensive card, but we'll see. Let's see if these Metal Raiders packs can give us three to the front. Got Ryukushin Powered, Paralyzing Potion, Tainted Wisdom. Don't worry, we'll get that thing sleeved up after the video i don't have any sleeves out right now so we'll have to wait bottom dweller let's do a blue eyes pack let's see if we can get that lob infamous blue eyes white dragon my opinion i think the blue eyes white dragon from this set is the best art i don't think there's anything that can compare taihon fusionist drooling lizard let's go into our other metal raiders pack and see if we can get a summon skull would be nice too. We got Skull Knight, we got Hunter Spider, Ring of Magnetism, 
Armored Zombie, and uh, Steel Scorpion, Water Omotix, Hoshin and again, Lady of Faith. That's not what we're wanting there. Okay, we got a couple Blue Eyes packs in here, and I think another Wild Survivors as well. Can we get... We got Tell Us the Little Angel. Tell Us What. Can we get another... Uh, what was that? Three to the front I did? So let's do two this time. Incantation. Talismandra. Lost World. Hungry Burger. Actually, I think Hungry Burger is a uh, collector's rare in this set. I guess the cards are in different spots if it's a different rarity. Which is kind of weird, but whatever. Come on. Give us something good here it's it there's three cards that i wouldn't mind pulling out of this it's the blue eyes dark magician or red eyes so i will literally take any of those or, well I, there are exodia pieces so i'm actually not opposed to any of those as well we've got dark world archives not a bad dark world card there we have three magnificent mavens uh, this is the Dark Magician girl set. We need, have not pulled that yet. Um, we've pulled quite a few of the, um, what are the Pharaoh's Rares cards out of this set. But I haven't really pulled any of the huge hitter cards, like the Blue Eyes, the Dark Magician girl. I did pull the, uh, Ritual Bluffs, Black Luster Soldier. I pulled the gray uh, Necro Valley, and what else? I mean, I'm pretty pretty sure I pulled the Change of Far. Quite a few of the really nice uh, Pharaoh's rares. I'm not sure if I pulled the. Uh, uh, there's like two types of rarities, but man, we're not doing too hot on these pulls. But all it takes is one. All it takes is one. One sick Pharaoh's Rare pool. Apollosa is a good card. We'll definitely uh, set that aside. Still has some value. Shadow Imprisoning Mirror. Chaos Hunter. Dragon Maid Changeover. Depending if I want to end on Blue Eyes or if I want to end on Magnificent Mavens. Probably going to end on the Mavens. Just because the hype of pulling... Ooh, Flame Swordsman. Uh, I saw a fusion. I was not expecting anything there. I was thought it was just a rare. Flame Swordsman's good, though. Flame Swordsman just got a lot of support. And the uh, Maze of Millennia, I believe. With the uh, crazy ultra rare bonfire card. Ray's Body Heat, which will probably be reprinted in the uh, Rarity Collection 2. Or something like that. Come on, give us a blue eyes, man. Armored Starfish. Yeah, but the one thing I think they should have done with the... Uh, man, I feel like they keep pulling the same cards out of there. These packs are not good. That's alright, we're saving all of our luck for the last pack. And last pack is going to have... Skull Redbird, I swear. Like, that's such an iconic card to me. Blue, Blue, uh, Legend of Blue Eyes is just the best set ever. Aquam Door and Fiend Reflection number two. Nope, not what we wanted. All right, last pack magic. If you've made it this far, like the video, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe as we get a really nice Yadagarasu. Really good iconic card as well. Uh, I, I want to do more Yu-Gi-Oh openings, so if you guys want to see more of those, let me know. I, I plan on doing more, so definitely stay tuned if you want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh! on this channel. And, uh, unfortunately we did not get the, uh, Pharaoh's Rares that we were looking for. But thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Pokemon Ninja out.